So this is what my office looks like this morning. Working on some filing. Those are some boxes that I assembled. I did assemble that one box. I know some of you may not believe that after watching the video the other day, but right now this is how it looks. And there is a reason behind this. Yeah, good morning. It's kind of hard to do a video when you got all this stuff sitting around you and you know you're getting ready to have to go through all of it. But uh, you know, that's, that's that's part of it, you know. We're t I was telling you, uh, was telling you yesterday that teaching is a job, and administration is a job, and this is the job part. Uh, we have all kind of procedures and all kind of regulations for all this kind of stuff, and um, we still got the bells ringing. There's there hadn't been a kid in this school for a week. Anyway, um, maybe the bell the bell will probably ring again in three minutes. So get ready for that. But uh, anyhow. We got um, all these stuff, you know, all these rules and stuff we have to follow. And, um, you know, this is, this is not a time here to be thinking outside of the box. <laughs> this, is, this is a time to be following all the rules uh, because we have to save uh, a lot of this stuff. Now, some of the stuff is, is just my personal things. Uh, I mean, not out here, not all of this, but some of the files and stuff that I keep are mine. But a lot of this stuff we have to save and we have to save it at our school for a couple of years and we have to ship it off. Uh, and the uh, ladies, you know, at the warehouse and the men at the warehouse get it and they file all this stuff and then we keep it for five years or seven years, depending on what kind of file it is. You know, and you may ask, well, why do, why do you do that? That seems like a lot of, oh, that's a lot of paper. That's a lot of space. You gotta pay all those people. Well, I'm gonna tell you why. Because four years down the road, when uh, some lady's sitting at home on her couch and she's watching, uh, you know, watching uh, some reality show on TV and then a lawyer comes on there and the lawyer says something about, um, you know, has your child been bullied? We can uh, help you, you know, we'll help you sue the school, you know, whatever. And so she hears that and she thinks, well, you know what? Now I remember when, uh, when Johnny was in sixth grade, uh, a girl called him a name. I remember he came home, the girl called him a name. I called down there to the school to Mr. Nichols and, you know, I told him what happened. He was bullied on that day because she called him a name, and and then after that he failed all of his milestones test, and then he and then he didn't make good grades that year. Now he's in high school and he's failing everything. He's wanting to quit school, and they just sent him on a spiral of depression and anxiety. And now he can't do anything because that girl called him a name. And I'm going to go back. I'm going to get me a lawyer. Well, we can go back, pull all of our records, and get the box that has the discipline stuff. And they can pull it out and they can say, oh, uh, Miss So-and-so, on that day when Johnny got called a name, uh, you called Mr. Nichols and this is what time that you called him and then he called you back at this number. And then he investigated it and he found out that on the day that Johnny got called a name, that uh, the girl that called Johnny a name, he was behind her in the lunch line and, uh, and he kicked her in the leg and then he pulled her hair and then he called her three names and then finally she turned around and called him a name and the teacher heard her calling him a name and so turned that in and then Johnny came home and told you that the girl called him a name. And that's what happened on that day. So now you can't sue the school because they took care of that on that day. And then when I'm sitting there retired three years down the road, they're not gonna be calling me down to some courtroom and um, asking me to testify uh, or you know sue me personally uh, because Johnny got called a name in sixth grade and now, now he can't function. So y'all keep good care of all these records. Make sure we don't lose these because I do know people that got sued after they retired. I know a guy that is like two years after he retired, he was getting sued over something that happened when he was an assistant principal. So don't watch the lawyer videos on TV uh, the lawyer commercials. Don't watch the lawyer commercials on TV and uh, y'all take good care of these records. I tried to keep detailed records. Don't sue me.